what are they offering to you? They are accepting your unilateral declaration of neutrality. It's a unilateral declaration. That's all. There has been no agreement from the other countries on respecting your neutrality. They say that the guarantees were agreed with the other 26 countries. This is not true. Because if they were agreed, the other 26 countries would ask for the same guarantees or other guarantees. And then they would have to re-ratify the treaty in all the other countries. So they are lying. They are cheating. There is no, they are not offering you anything else than what was offered in the last referendum. Uh, you probably have seen also some weeks ago that the German Court of Justice has uh, given authority to the German government to ratify the Lisbon Treaty. But they have said that they will allow ratification if uh, this is limited to certain areas. And that they have expressly said that areas related to fiscal, to tax uh, laws, areas related to social laws are national responsibility and can only be uh, decided by the national parliaments. They have also said that they will not accept the fact that the European law has supremacy over the German law. These limitations that the German court has put to this treaty would require that this treaty goes for ratification again in all the countries. Are you going to accept that these people have these guarantees? These are real guarantees, limitations, and you don't have them. This is totally unfair. So you need to know that if you ratify this treaty, uh, you will be in a very unfavorable position from a start compared to Germany, who already has very uh, has bigger, se sensibly bigger uh, voting rights. So I think I cannot tell you more about my thoughts about this uh, Lisbon Treaty and. I am not coming here to tell you how to, you have to vote. Uh, I'm coming here to tell you what I have seen from inside. I'm coming here to tell you that I, if I had the opportunity to vote, I would say no, because I wouldn't like my children or the children of my children to have to be ruled by such a political elite whose interests are far from the interests of the European people. Thank you. To find out more about who we are and what we stand for, go to the UK Independence Party website at www.ukip.org.